Yo, what's up guys? Today we're going to be doing the Underbog Dungeon. This one has four bosses instead of three. And also has a lot of critters. These things are underbar lurkers, shamans, and these guys are underbats. These ones are bog giants. Yeah, he, he literally just killed that toad. This thing is so... No. Cool. Oh no, I got that myself. Right, yeah, all these guys are. Well, they're all like corpses now, but still. Another big thud. Every now and then, the micro defender will shoot out a beam towards a critter that will also one shot it. That will one shot any critter. What's in this water? You might be wondering. It's these things called the underbug frenzies. Once again, some more of these guys here. Oh! Well, I got both of them for me. Alright. Well, that one ability just straight up took both of them down. And this guy is the first boss of the instance Hungerfin. He looks like the final. He looks similar to the final boss. He's a big bog giant, just like the final boss of the first. Dungeon that I covered here. That's a flying underbat. Wow. He's got an interesting mouth there. I never looked at those bog giants like up close. That was my first time. I thought they were gonna go after my little pet guardian here. Oh, pet defender. These guys are like, whenever you defeat them, they do a sound of. They do a. Sound for when you do a. Sound for when you defeat them. These guys see the broken dread eye. So there's a bunch of frenzies in this water, right? Yeah. You're right yes, you're right about that. The second boss is also 
Oh, he's trying to come. Oh, he's coming out of the water. Oh, he wants to fight me. Okay. The second boss actually wants to fight you if you decide to go down to his pool before he, you... If you defeat him... These, ra these fish will just die on their own because the water gets so hot that the danger of this is gone as soon as he dies. Literally, all the all the razor fish that were in this water are, are dead. And you can't even click on them afterwards either. Alright. The next part of the instance is through this hole. But I'm gonna make it a little fast for you guys to see. Wow, almost took a lot of fall damage. Yeah, I know there's like some guy back here, I think. I remember there's a yeah, this guy. Thank goodness for you. Claude and I were investigating this place where we were jumped by the Swamp Lord. Musilic. Muta. Musilic. Yeah, I can. Yes, guys, I can. Actually, can be funny at times. Like, like now. <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. I was just trying to be funny, right? Whew. These are Lyco wasps and stingers. These guys are. Oh, it just killed another critter. Okay. Fen rays. This is the Swamp Lord Muscle Skin Claw. I'm gonna do a little trick here so I save myself some time and get both of them at once. Defeat Swamp Lord Muscle because he's the bad guy. And Claw, you can also talk to him. He says, How embarrassing to be taken as a pet by a hunter! I earned you my life. Now that you freed me from Muscle. I can find my way out now. Thanks to you. These are Underbog Lords. These are more powerful versions of the Bog Giants from pre earlier. In the final boss, and you can arrive to the final boss shortly after defeating the third one. Just two of these guys, and then. Here's the final boss. He's known as the Black Stalker. He's killed all these fan rays. That's a lot of dead fan rays. Right. Ooh, he's a big. He's tall, but not beefy. He's a very tall boss. That's how big he is. He's a he's a fan strider. That's what he is. Alright. If you're wondering what happens after you defeat him, well, after you defeat the final boss, you go to this area here. It's a little loophole shortcut right here. Ooh, and little toad spawned back in. This place is still mostly tormented. Mostly free from the Naga. But... It's kind of evolved in this. Yeah, he said something there. Alright. Sorry, buddy. I gotta dismiss you. I have to... It's like, No, please don't take... Please don't put me back. I'm like, I'm sorry, buddy. I have to. I gotta end the video here. Oh. It's like, Oh, I'm, that's too bad. I'm like, Oh, that's how life is, buddy. Alright. So, that's the end of... Well... Where the black stalker was was actually the end of the instance, but the loophole is the true end of the instance.
So thank you guys for watch so much for watching. Make sure to for real positively comment, like, and subscribe. Tap the notification bell and share this with others. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye, Z's.